Well, my toilet's at it again, but this time instead of snakes, it sounds like a really exasperated mermaid. It's watery. Sigh. It's running water in my tank. And sometimes it'll just work itself out. You give it a little jiggle and it will settle down. But if you forget to do the jiggly do, uh, it can become a very costly, annoying sound and all of that water just keeps running and running into the bowl. What's happening is the little flapper stopper is getting stuck. Sometimes the chain might get in the way. Sometimes it just doesn't want to close and it just kind of gets stuck here. And it's not sealing all the rest of the way and allowing the water to fill the tank. Tried a bunch of different things, trying to just loosen up the flapper, uh, replacing the chain, but I caved and just gone ahead and bought a replacement. So our good friend Corky is back with a flapper seal repair kit, and we'll see how this goes. We've already set aside the toilet plant, so now the next step is to turn off the water and drain the tank. We are replacing this flapper, so we must remove this. It's kind of fold up around the sides there. So that is called the drain seat, and we have to clean that up pretty well. They recommend using steel wool. I don't have any, so I'm going to use the scratchy green side of a sponge and see how well that does. If it doesn't do well, it's all on me. All right, the drain seat is now clean and dry, and we're going to put a new seal on top of it and fix it with the Easy Fix Quick Dry Sealant. Use the cap, punch it, and let's blaze this donut. That looks good and messy. Let's put this on top of the drain seat. And press down, get that nice and tight. Now we wait 15 minutes for that to dry. All right, it's quarter to tuft to titmouse, so now it's time to put on the new flapper. All right, so these little arms will just pull over, I don't know what they're called. You can attach it, you can figure it out. You're smart people. And we'll take the end of this chain and attach it to the arm. Attach. You'll turn the water back on. <laughs> All right, the tank is filled, so let's test out our new flapper. It worked. Final step, replace the toilet plant and then sign off on your YouTube video tutorial. That was how you replace an old toilet flapper to stop a leaky toilet tank. Hopefully that was helpful. Good luck on your project.